Morning friends, this is the video from Soft Illusion. Today, let's draw a locus of ellipse through three points. So, the conditions are the two point should lie on major and minor axis respectively and the third point should be nearer to the second point that is the point lying on minor axis. So, give this problem a try. There can be geometric solution as well as algebraic solution. But if you try algebraic solution, it is a difficult task. So, we have a simple method using GeoGebra. So, first, let's learn the properties which we need of ellipse. So, in an ellipse, if you take any point P and the focal points of ellipse are F and F dash, then FP plus FP dash will be equal to the major axis that is twice R where R is the semi major axis. So So the pictorial representation shows that M plus N equals to 2S and the second property is if in a semicircle if the end points of diameter are A and B and if you take any point on semicircle and join it to the points it will always subtend 90 degree that is right angle so these are the properties which we will use so let's see the physical scenario so let's take two points of an ellipse and fix them oops so fix the points and as we saw point B is nearer to C now let's join point A and B okay so now let's take a perpendicular bisector to this line and now we will draw a semicircle through these points semicircle from this to this so here we get the center of ellipse to be somewhere on this axis now we will make the major axis and minor axis that means BD will be the minor axis and AD will be the major axis so if you find the reflecting points through this line through this line we get all four vertices of ellipse now let's hide this perpendicular bisector now we need to find focus focal point of ellipse so as we learn the property that distance ad which is r so let's calculate distance ad at and save it in q so distance it will take lines so let's draw a line this line will be parallel to this one so line is j and i so let's save 
the distance between A and D which is equal to distance between line J and line I. So we saw here the number Q so the distance is changing if we go near it becomes zero that means we are on a correct verge so now so distance ad let's draw a circle from point p with distance of q so here we get focal points so now we are with four points two focal points and a moving center so we can calculate ellipse with two focal points and so now we will hide the remaining things that is a cone a circle so we got an ellipse passing through two points a and b now as the condition says we need to pass ellipse from point C. So let's draw a parallel line. So it will be parallel line from this to point C. So now we get GC as the offset distance. If we change this point and make Find point is let's see our third point is here so we'll fix it out now if we make GC so let's distance 11 so if we touch it and make the distance 0 that means we got the desired circle point zero 1. So we made it 0 that means we got a circle of equation sorry we got an ellipse of equation this which passes through all our three points A, B and C. So this is a simple hack to draw an ellipse. So thank you. If you like the video, do share it and subscribe the channel.